Police equipment swiped from patrol cars, leaving several agencies investigating who's breaking in and stealing their stuff. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kevin Kelly. I'm Donna Terrell. Guns and bulletproof vests are a few things stolen over the last two weeks across Pulaski County. Arkansas State Police, Pulaski County, North Little Rock, and Sherwood officers all investigating. Fox 16's Mitch McCoy taking a closer look at what's been stolen. It's first on Fox tonight. Kevin and Donna, good evening. These suspects are smashing out the windows to patrol cars. According to some of the police reports that we've received, the perps may have a wide range of equipment tonight from badges to guns. And of course, that causes worry for some. Trevor Freemeyer has lived in North Little Rock's Argenta district for several years. He says the area is safe with a strong police presence. There's going to be a cop rolling around or someone that's living by. There's a lot of police officers that live in the area, so that's a good feeling. But recent thefts involving patrol cars are concerning Trevor. It seems like they uh, at least know what they're doing. The patrol car break-ins happening near officers' homes. We're not sharing exact addresses for officer safety reasons, but they are happening as south as Otter Creek to Sherwood. Over the last week and a half, guns, bulletproof vests, tasers, badges, and rifles have been stolen. In other cases, the suspect only smashed the patrol car's window and did not take anything. It's not a good good thing to hear at all. No, a lot of people can be hurt. Craig Ludwig lives in North Little Rock. He says knowing the thieves are now armed with police equipment could make them more bold. There's nothing to stop them. It's a little alerting. Trevor says he still feels safe knowing officers, deputies, and troopers will get their equipment back in no time. Whatever's been stolen, I'm sure our guys are fully equipped and will have backups or, you know, even further advancements. In some of these cases where patrol cars have been broken into, other random cars were broken into as well. Guys, several of my sources telling me that all of these police agencies are now working together to find the people responsible. If you know who's doing this, you are asked to call police as soon as possible. Kevin?